Now, in this video, I'm going to give you a brief overview of the various online academic journals that are available for students. I'm in the CIT Library online database. If I scroll down to the end here, I have the online databases. I press that, and here I have a list of all of the various database types. So the first is the Emerald Insight database. This is a good database for those students studying business and commerce. Then there is the EBSCO database, which again is a database used for students studying business and commerce. Then there's the Science Direct database, which is used for science-based subjects, business, arts, humanities, social sciences. It's quite a comprehensive database. Then there's Scopus, so that is in relation to the fields of science, technology, medicine, social sciences, and the arts and humanities again, so it's quite comprehensive. We have the IHS database, which is in regards to construction, health and safety, building projects, and uh, so forth, manufacturing and electronic equipment, so if that's the area of work or chemical engineering, if that is your area of study, then this would be the website for you, the journal for you. And then there's for the students studying arts, there's the Art Store Digital Library Day uh, Journal. And again, it's quite comprehensive in regards to subject matter of studying the arts. We have the IEEE, which is the database journal for those studying electronics and engineering and so forth. Quite good with computers as well, computer science based uh, papers. Then we have the Math Scinet, Mathematical Reviews, which is based on the mathematical sciences and possibly physics as well. So this is the International Telecommunications Union Standards, uh, so this would be quite good for those students studying ICT, computers, multimedia and so forth. And as well as that we have the ACM, which is the Computer Science Journal. And here we have the JSTOR, which is quite useful for those students in the studying arts, sociology, it's, it's mathematics as well, history and so forth. Then we have the BASE Digital Collections, and it states that it's a multidisciplinary search engine for scholarly research, so that could be your one-stop shop for all of your study needs. And we have the Cochrane Database, which is medicine-based, biological sciences-based, journal, online journal. This is a localized Irish-based research portal. And here we have the Educational Resources Information Center, which is for those students studying educational sciences or educational-based courses. This would be the journal that might be of interest to you. So that is the end of this particular video tutorial, just outlining the various online journals that are available to you. Again, these journals would be, shall we say, the definitive standard for any form of peer-reviewed research. That is to say that if you cite these particular research papers in your assignment or report for college, then they would be considered the gold standard in terms of references. So that's the end of this video tutorial and thank you for watching.